Instagram is playing catch up. That's right. The company is rolling back several changes after the release of its latest update. Instagram faced a backlash for rolling out an update to make the app more similar to TikTok. Users expressed frustrations with the app's shift from focusing on pictures to video content. This comes as Instagram's parent company Meta announced its first ever drop in revenue. CBS News tech reporter Dan Patterson joins us now for more on this. Dan, good to see you. Good to see you. Meta is one of the largest companies in the world. How are they trying to keep up with TikTok? Well, for years, we've been accustomed to algorithmically sorted content, right? So you follow or you friend somebody or an account, and you don't see updates in real time. You can. That's a setting. But often you see the content from those accounts you followed or friended in an order that Facebook or other social networks think is most engaging. But again, this is content that you have opted into, that you've friended or followed. Now, they are mimicking a feature of TikTok, which is algorithmic, algorithmically organized or sorted content. This is stuff that comes from elsewhere that the algorithm thinks you might like, it might fit your interests, but you have not opted into. This is a pretty big change for these networks that, if you'll recall, kind of based their entire social graph on your friends, your family, and people that you care about. So that's why I've been getting a lot on travel, a lot on food, a lot on <laughs> things that, you know, I hadn't liked, you know, hashtag in the past. So after the changes to the app were announced, the head of Instagram backtracked on the updates, but then Mark Zuckerberg said they would stay in some form. Uh, why is there so much dysfunction with Instagram? Well, we see that Facebook and Instagram, the apps Facebook and Instagram, are being used kind of as tools now to fend off this competition. For years, these were kind of pure play apps. We saw Facebook, the blue app they call it, as a social network where you follow your friends and family, your interests. Uh, Instagram was a pure play photo app. For a long time, it was pictures, cool stuff that you might want to follow, influencers, dogs. Uh, I <laughs> like dogs. Uh, so you would see a lot of stuff that you were interested in, but once again, pictures or friends and family posts. Now they are using these apps to fend off competition because that competition is pretty fierce. This tactic worked fairly successfully. Facebook used Instagram. Actually, they bought Instagram because they were kind of uh, lagging on their own mobile apps 10 years ago in 2000, April 2012. Facebook bought Instagram to help boost their photos. Uh, but they've used Instagram and Facebook to fend off like uh, Snapchat and other competitors. Now they are trying to use it once again as a tool to fend off competition. This world makes my head spin a little bit. Dan, should people expect more changes from Facebook and Instagram this year? Yeah, we should expect those changes to kind of follow that pattern. Sadly, these are no longer peer play applications. These are designed to be businesses, right? They are designed for revenue. And when revenue is at stake, look, we're seeing tech and all other companies kind of tighten their belts. And Facebook is no exception. They need to generate revenue, which means they need more ads, which means they need to fend off competition, which means they need to algorithmically sort content to make sure that you stay on the site viewing and tapping on those ads. Let's look at it. Let's face it. Mar it's a marketplace now. I That's mean, right. you can buy clothes, you can buy products, <laughs> you can buy appliances. I mean, everything's on Instagram these days. Dan Patterson, uh, we want to thank you. We want to thank you for all that you brought to the stream. This is your uh, last you guys are day. Great. And I'm, we just, we're going to miss you so much. I'll miss you guys too. We'll it's great you. to see you. Thank you very much. Good luck. Thanks.